Hey everybody, it's Brett and today I am super excited to go over this brand new 2024 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon X 4xE in bikini pearl coat. Stock number on this one is 24J191. I will link the description for this one as well as the original window sticker in the uh, comments or in the description below on the YouTube channel as well as a link to this vehicle on our website. This one of course has the 2.0 liter four cylinder turbocharged engine. It's paired up with the hybrid system. It's gonna get you 375 combined horsepower and 470 foot pounds of torque. It's gonna give you 49 miles per gallon equivalent and a 370 mile driving range. You're gonna be able to charge this one in just about 12 hours on 120 volt and about two hours on a 240 volt charger. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, show you all the options, um, just go over all, everything on the vehicle. Let me know what you think is the favorite part, your favorite part of this Wrangler. For me right now, it's the color, it's the blue accents with the four by E and the metal bumpers and everything. Uh, this one does have the satin finish black grille, which is pretty much the only optional equipment that's been put on this vehicle. Of course, all the LED headlamps, running lights, and fog lights, all part of that uh, Rubicon X package standard. You get the black and blue hood decal on there, anti-glare, the color match fenders, the color match hard top as well. You get the trail rated badge on the side, on this side as well, because they have the antennas in the windshields now. This is of course Corning Gorilla Glass. You still get the sandals on the shroud there. This one is pretty easy to see. Sometimes they are pretty hard to see. You get seven slots in the vent there, as well as seven slots on that grill. This one does have the front trail cam on it. You get the blue tow hooks with the four by E package and of course, the metal bumpers all come standard with the Rubicon X package. You get the painted and polished aluminum wheels. You get the blue Jeep logo with the 4xE package. This one has BF Goodrich All-Terrain TA KO2 tires. These are LT285 70R17s and a nice all-terrain tread pattern to them. Get a look at the suspension there. And this one does have the rock rails with the Rubicon X package standard. You can take these doors off. They got T50 on there. That's for the Torx 50 bit that you have to use to take those doors off. We did a demo on how to take your doors off your JL. That is in the description below, linked in the description below. You also have a 3M rock guard on these back fenders. Color match hard top, like I said. This one does have the sport brakes in the back. You can tell if they've got those little slots, they're the sport brakes, and that's standard on the Rubicon X package as well. Coming around to the back, backup parking sensors, you get the receiver hitch, four pin and seven pin wiring. Now I believe this one, because it doesn't have the 35 inch tire and wheel group, that this one has a max tow capacity of 3,500 pounds. Uh, let me know if I'm wrong in the comments below. Uh, this one does have the backup LED or the LED lights for the back tail lights. There's the matching spare. Take a quick look at the back here. You get your case for your front hard top pieces. You also get your charger back here. And this is a case for that charger. You also have the Alpine premium sound system with the subwoofer back here. And uh, this must be an extension cord. Well, this must be the big charger. I'm not sure what this is. Not sure what that is. Let me know if you know what it is in the comments below, but here's the normal charger. Anyways, you get holes for your door hinge, roof, and windshield bolts. This one has the insulated hard top. A little bit better sound deadening and keeps it a little bit warmer. You get four bolts on each side, take this hard top off. We did a demo on how to take your hard top off. Once again, if you want to check that out, that's in the description below. Seven slots on the back here. You get the two door, four door wheelbase and overall length as well as water fording on there where it's developed and built in too. And just really like this bikini blue pearl coat. Let's take a look at that metallic flake in it because it does have a lot of metal flake in it looks really good really a cool color 
You get the black fuel door on here. This one does have blind spot monitoring, the heated mirrors, the enter and go system. Show you the back seats real quick. You get the blue stitching with the hybrid package. Latch child safety system. So these seats go down just a little bit different than your normal Wrangler because this is where the batteries are on, on these vehicles. There's also a Jeep climbing up a hill there. One of the Easter eggs of the 4xE. And then these seats go down like so. So you get a little bit of a different level when you put these back seats down on a normal Wrangler. They go pretty much flat to the floor. These have a lip to them to the back storage area. And then they just go back like that. Factory floor mats back here. You get 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in and two USBs, two USB-Cs. The other big thing for 2024 that they changed, you get side curtain airbags now, standard. And they also changed where the map lights are and the speakers are back here. You also get child safety locks in those back doors. Let's check out these front seats because this is probably one of my favorite interiors I have for the Wrangler. The black with the blue stitching, the power seats, those were new for 2024. And these seats are, it's a, it's a really soft leather, but it's stiff, if that makes any sense. Um, you get the Rubicon stitch into the backrest. It's a soft touch, but it's a stiff leather, so it feels like it's going to be really sturdy and hold up a long time. You get factory floor mats down there. This is your hybrid system, so you can put it in hybrid mode, just electric mode or e-save mode, and basically just run on the gas engine. Uh, this is definitely, I think, hybrids are, if you're going to go any sort of electric, do the hybrid because you'll never be stuck. Uh, if you run out of battery, you should still have gas. If you run out of gas, you should have a little bit of hybrid left to get to where you need to go. Tilt telescopic steering wheel, but those are the controls for the hybrid system. You get this kind of Gore-Tex finish on the dash with the blue trim with the hybrid. Once again, you get the blue stitching on the doors, power locks and mirrors. I'm not going to go through the instrument cluster or the radio too much. I'm just going to show you the steering wheel here. You get the blue stitching on the insides of that steering wheel. Once again, this leather is like a soft touch leather. You get the Gorilla and the windshield. Uh, Bluetooth information center controls on the left, audio controls in the back, and cruise controls and adaptive cruise controls on the right. Now, this one has the Uconnect 12.3 inch Uconnect 5 radio. This one does have the navigation system, which you get with the um, Alpine premium sound system and there's highway 41 and this system's supposed to be five times faster than the Uconnect 4 systems that they had in the Wranglers before you get AM FM and Sirius XM radio capabilities you get all your different apps on here I'm not going to go through everything but I'm just going to quickly show you these Android Auto Apple CarPlay this one does have off-road pages you get the hybrid electric mode um, stuff and you could go through that, Let's see what's in there. So you get the e-hybrid, how many kilowatts you got going on, driving history, schedules, e-save. So a lot of really neat stuff that you could do in here. Um, also you have your cameras on here, which I'll show you those, because they've made these HD. Crystal clear. Get the back camera, the front camera. Now those are dynamic grid lines. So as I turn that steering wheel, those lines change, which would be ultra handy if you're off-roading so that you're not going to hit any logs or rocks or anything and wreck your wheels. Down here are your more tactile volume tune and climate controls. This is your east or uh, regen mode. So when you have this on, it's actually going to use the brakes and basically everything that's slowing the vehicle down to recharge those batteries. So it's it's a recharge mode. And it's very noticeable when you turn that on and you're driving because the vehicle slows down extremely quickly without even hitting the brakes. Stability control, uh, speed select crawl control, parking sensors, USB, AUX, USB-C, four auxiliary um, upfit switches, off-road plus mode, sway bar disconnect, front and rear locking axles or the rear axle. This is what makes a Rubicon a Rubicon. And the 4x4 shifter on the floor, 8-speed automatic transmission, keyless entry with a remote start, and the flipper key on there. And then, of course, you get that kind of Gore-Tex finish on the dash there as well. You get the insulated hardtop pieces up here, too. 
assistant SOS buttons. And you can tell, I can tell when I'm talking in these videos, it's, it's definitely more of a, a damped, dampened uh, sound. It's not as echoey in here and uh, sounds really good. Auto dimming mirror and your home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. So I am gonna go turn on all the lights and then turn off the lights in the picture studio so that you can see um, how bright they are. And then just do a final walk around. Oh, this is where you charge your vehicle. So just plug it in right there and it'll blink at you if it's charging or not charging or full or not full. So let me know what you think of this Wrangler in the comments below. Kind of a quick video. I'm also gonna show you the original window sticker at the end of the video if you don't wanna click the link below. I think it's easier to click the link below, but we'll go through the original window sticker here. So give me a second to turn off all these lights. I'll do a final walk around, show you how bright they are, show you the original window sticker, and then we'll be all done. All right, you can see just how bright these lights are. Uh, so glad Jeep made the LED light, lighting group standard on pretty much all the packages. You can see just how nice and bright those lights are. And it's a nice, clean, white light from those LEDs. Very nice visibility with those lights. And the LED tail lamps are very good looking as well. You also get the LED license plate lights. And these are definitely, you know, you're following a Wrangler uh, with that pattern on there. So I'll turn the lights back on in the studio here, and then we will take a look at the original window sticker. Thank you so much for checking out the video. If you don't want to stick around for the original window sticker, I get it. It's linked in the description below. Uh, but let me know what you liked about the video, what you didn't like about the video. Uh, we do videos like this each and every day, so subscribe to the YouTube channel. And here is the original window sticker as promised. 2024 Wrangler four-door Rubicon X 4xE. Bikini pearl coat, black interior, Napa leather seats, the two liter dual overhead cam i4 turbo, eight speed automatic transmission. Everything on your left there is your standard equipment. And then your first optional equipment is bikini pearl coat, which is $8.95. That is $300 more than any other paint color that you can get. So bikini is $300 more than any color I have seen. And this is a 29Y package. The Rubicon X 4xE is a 29Y, and that is a $9,000 option, Rubicon X. Get everything eight right here. Four-way power lumbar adjustable front passenger seat, eight-way power adjustable driver seat, eight-way power adjustable front passenger seat, eight-way power lumbar adjustable driver seat. Heated front seats, heated steering wheel, acoustic front seat area carpet, acoustic laminated front door glass, Alpine premium sound, HD radio, active noise control system, connected travel and traffic services, Uconnect 5 nav with the 12.3 touchscreen, Napa leather seats, body color highline flare or the fender flares, the body color three-piece hardtop, blind spot and cross path detection, remote start, automatic high beam headlamp control, park sense rear park assist system, integrated off-road camera, rear window defrost, rear window wiper washer, hardtop headliner by Mopar, no soft top, Freedom panel storage bag, steel front and rear bumpers, and then the performance satin black grill is a $325 option. Total MSRP on this Wrangler is $73,510. And if you want to get your summit price in the upper right-hand part of the screen or in the description below is a link to this vehicle on our website with all the rebates, incentives, and availability. If it says sold in the title of this video, it's probably sold. If it doesn't say sold, good chance it's still available. 3 or 36 bumper to bumper, 5 year 60 powertrain, and then your hybrid system and hybrid voltage battery warranties are 8 year 100,000 miles. So definitely a great warranty on the batteries um, and hybrid system on this vehicle. There's your 49 miles per gallon equivalent, 20 miles, or it's going to get you 20 miles per gallon on just the gasoline engine. So your total combined range is 370 miles. You're going to get about 21 miles on electric. And then annual fuel cost is 2100 bucks. And then your greenhouse and small gratings are closer to the best than the other Wranglers. It's only rated for rollover of three stars. And that is the original window sticker, like I said. Linked in the description below, as along with the full description of this vehicle. Thank you so much for checking out the video. If you like the video, 
uh, consider subscribing to the YouTube channel. If you want to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, specifically Wranglers, go to that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle on our lot, all at summitauto.com. If you want to check out more videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and Jeep and specifically Jeep Wrangler walkarounds on YouTube. Over 9,000 videos on that web, on that YouTube channel and over 500 Wrangler videos on there, including this one. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to the YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Wrangler videos I've ever done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. Let me know what you liked, what you didn't like, how you liked the color, and uh, thank you so much for checking out the video. And until our next video, thanks again.